everybody wants to know if silverware should be put face up or face down in a dishwasher. I say face down because it's ultimately going to clean everything and all the water is going to drip down and eventually it's going to dry out. But when you take it out, most people don't wash their hands before they empty the dishwasher. And you're going to probably touch the handle. If you put it face up, you're going to touch the very part that you're trying to clean to begin with. It's all valid points. But, you know, if you put them down, they're all bunched together, too. So they're all like, because if they're up, then they have all this freedom to move around and they can they kind of spread out. But if you put them all inside, then they, they're compressed. I think that's still going to be cleaner than my hands touching the fork heads. Yeah, I guess maybe it's a preferential matter, like whether or not you prefer germs over food. Like if you don't mind food on the, the then you'd put them face down and that's where some of the silver actually stick together too. Well, I don't know how many people do that. I mean, I know anytime I use a dishwasher, I don't trust it. That's why I usually don't use a dishwasher. But if I do, I always check it. Because I, I, cups, plates, almost nothing is, unless you pre-wash. But if you're pre-washing, I, see this whole stupid thing is stupid. It's like the whole dishwasher is a scam. If you really want to use it right, what you're supposed to do is pre-wash your dish and then put yeah, it in there. And it's like, if I'm pre-washing, I might as well just finish washing yeah, the dishes. Yeah, it's so stupid. Yeah, it's all I, a scam. I don't that but yeah, I mean, I've, I know I've put many like spoons and forks and stuff inside of a dishwasher before. Oh, yeah. And yeah. sometimes like spoons will cleave together and they'll actually know each other. They'll actually spoon. Oh, yeah. They're like, they fork. Yeah. Well, yeah, the forks will fork each other. The spoons yeah. are spooning each other. Yeah. And then what happens is the water doesn't get in betwixt them. Yeah. So when you pull them out and you finally uh, separate them, you still see the residue. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know if it's bioluminescent or not, but it is. It's disgusting. You can see it. It's clear. Yeah. It happens with everything. It happens with the cups. It happens with the plates. Happens with the spoons, the forks, the knives, anything. And so I just don't, honest, if I'm honest, I don't ever use a dish. I have a nice dishwasher and I don't ever use it. And you know, it's a scam because they tell you if you don't use your dishwasher at least once a week, there's that seal that goes around it. They say that it could deteriorate. <clears throat> and it's like this whole thing is just a scam. Yeah, the only thing deteriorating is our faith in the dishwashers. Yeah, and you know, I get it. We want our lives to be like the Jetsons, and we want everything automated. But the dishwasher ain't it. it it's not it. Not well, if you want something to clean. If you want, <laughs> believe you want it clean. or not, believe it or not, there now is an answer to this world problem. Um, and they actually, it seems like, well, they would agree with what you're saying. That not with the dishwasher, of course. They're gonna uphold their truth but they're saying that you need to put the silverware down facing down pointy ends down i believe that's the most logical thing but i don't think it fixed the clean problem 